and then you need the bus back or something like that. If you folks, let us know if we can assist you. Just keep in mind there's about three of us and a lot more of you, so we'll be with you as soon as possible. Thank you. Beautiful 360 views. Alrighty, here we go. So our first cool view coming up is straight through the middle. If you're in the middle, look down for me. Don't worry, we replaced that glass after the last glass fell through. You got all so the on your pants, yeah, please. <laughs> That's a real Alrighty guys, so I'll make sure to point out everything on our right hand side as we come back. But coming up first on our left hand side, we have a really stunning view of the Timber Falls. Timber Falls is the second largest waterfall in the Blue Mountains. That water is fed from an underground spring and a hanging swamp, so that's never been dry in recorded history. That water that we can see actually becomes a part of Sydney's main drinking supply in six days' time. Now, if you're on the edges or in the middle, look straight down for me. We're actually 270 metres above the ground right now. That's twice the height of the Harbour Bridge. Yeah, you can see there's a few people on that lookout off to our left. What they really think of the minutes they get to where they are. They're actually paid actors. They just stand there 24 7 right away. Sign, you have a lovely view of the Three Sisters. 
their indigenous names from left to right are Minoi, Wimala, and Gunidu. There actually used to be five to seven of the sisters, but they've unfortunately fallen into the valley over time due to erosion. If you look closely though, you can see what's left of their little brother Kevin on the right hand side. And then directly out to our right hand side, we catch a beautiful view of Mount Solitary. That large flat mountain is a popular hiking and camping spot. That takes about four hours to walk out there one way. You can climb up the right side of the mountain. And then my favourite part of the trip coming up. In this corner over here, we have a really cool view of the Orphan Rock, that large pillar. That was a popular lookout until 1974, when a mudslide wiped out the entrance. So now it's unsafe for the public to get up there. But you can see there's a really dodgy handrail up on top, and there's a really dodgy uh, staircase on the right hand side, both built before Orphan Rock. It's super rare, but we have seen a couple of people actually climb up there and they lean on that balcony closest to us, which, as far as life choices go, is one of the worst ones you could make. Police are usually waiting for them back at the cliff line back up top, so it's actually a $2,000 round trip to check out Orphan Rock. That whole pillar is expected to fall in the next 100 to 300 years. And so for the people that don't know, we actually have a new experience called Beyond Skyway. It's a separate ticket, and we run it after City Club closes. We take four people at a time, pick you up in the harnesses, we go into the middle of the valley, we stop, and you actually climb up onto the middle. So you're actually on top of the roof, hooked into the, uh, the hall lines that you can see running all the way across. So you can actually lean out over the edge, lean straight down to the valley below. <laughs> All right, guys, it's going to be a couple of bumps, totally normal. Good stuff. So, I hope you had a nice time, guys. Our railway and cable entrances are both down the ground floor as well. You can check that out already. Thanks. Thank <laughs> you. 
If you'd like to rejoin the train line, you go over the bridge and rejoin the line on the right hand side. Thanks everybody. Okay. Okay, let's go up. Yeah. Maybe take a picture of us. Okay, going to close the doors and gates. Standing clear, doors and closing. Thank you. 
30 minutes is this one. station um if you haven't already worked out i like to have a bit of fun i don't know whether it's entertaining for you but it is entertaining for me um, so you're welcome to listen you're welcome to ask questions you're welcome to completely ignore me i am used to that my parents do it to me all the time now at the front of the cabin we have katuma falls those falls are 244 meters and an interesting fact about katuma falls they've never run dry in all of recorded history i know Wow, that's amazing. Oh, you guys are clearly not excited about that at all. Anyways, on the right hand side, 
Uh, we have the three sisters, yeah. uh, their names from left to right are Kim, Courtney and Chloe. Yeah. A few people are listening, I do appreciate it. I said you can ask me a question, now's the perfect time to. What is the actual name of the three sisters? Great question guys, thank you so much for asking. Uh, their names from left to right are Minai, Wumala and Gunny Do, in the local Gundagara and Darug languages. Now there is a geological belief that once upon a time there are seven sisters along that peninsula, however it is quite disputed to the truth behind that statement. Out at the back of the cabin we have Mount Solito, that tabletop mountain there. Now that tabletop mountain is about five kilometers away from us and about a kilometer larger in radius than Uluru. Um, these trees that we're passing on our left hand side, these are eucalyptus trees. We have over a hundred species of them up here in the mountains. They produce a eucalyptus oil. That oil is evaporated up into the air, mixes with dust and air particles, and when light shines through it, it reflects it into the blue spectrum, creating that blue haze you can see. This rock here on the right in the foreground, uh, you can see that gaping hole in the middle, staircase up the side, handrails on top, called Orphan Rock. It was a popular lookout back until its closure in 1974. That was closed for two reasons. Number one, a mudslide took out the entrance point. Number two, it was deemed unstable, just like my ex-girlfriend. <laughs> oh, you guys are actually listening. That is great to hear. I was just wondering if you're taking in blindly the information I was giving you. Um, so there you go. I do appreciate that. All right. Um, now, on the right-hand side, you might notice a white roller coaster track weaving through the foliage underneath us. Uh, you'll see it when you exit the car park as well today. Have a look above you. Um, you'll, once you notice it, you won't stop noticing it. Called the Orphan Rocker, it was a roller coaster track, um, operational in the 1980s. However, never actually open to the public. Uh, Singapore World decided that they didn't want to go towards a mass tourism route like you would see on the Gold Coast. Uh, rather, they wanted a bit more of a, an experience for the customers. Um, rather than just building their business as big as they can. Uh, so they built the cableway and the walkway instead. Um, there's going to be a small bump coming into the station here. Here we go. There we go. Beautiful. Now I'll open up the doors on the left hand side. That's the side that I am on. Make your way out through the shop floor. You'll be on level one. Level one is where you'll find the entrance to all the rides. Level two is where you'll find the cafe. Um, all our staff are super friendly, so we're more than happy to give you recommendations of things to do over your long weekend. By all staff, I mean everyone but Joe. Joe is not friendly at all. Don't speak to him. Have a wonderful day. Enjoy the weekend, guys. Thank you. It's me. <laughs> Just before we go, just be aware that we will all have to exit at the bottom just to accommodate everyone coming on board down there. Thanks everyone. We're going to close the doors now.
beautiful. Um, Does that mean going to have to walk to the top? The skyway. <laughs> no, they're going to have to walk to the top. 450 is the last one coming down. Maybe above. So this is the last ride there. Yeah? <laughs> Bailey, you're coming with me. Thank you. 
You can wait for Idrik. Okay, we stop here. Stop for here for a while. Yeah, we stop. Okay, let's go. What's that? Hey, hey, Joy, hey, Joy. Huh? Yeah. And then he fell down there. Did that? Yeah. Where? Uh, somewhere here. Uh, somewhere here. Yeah. Yeah. And all dirty. Oh, yeah. Oh, this one. Ventilation for Yeah, Okay, look. Oh, very dark. I oh, cannot see anything. Huh? You want to go down? Yeah. Okay. Okay, ventilator. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> That'll be fun, I don't anything. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Five o'clock? Yeah, yeah.